Jack Hodgins. Um, welcome back to my DJI channel. I thought I'd just quickly do a quick overview of my new website. As you can see, this is the, my new website. It's basically I've brought some hosting space from 123reg and also brought a database, MySQL database, to be able to run this. I'm using WordPress, uh, latest version of WordPress 3.09, I think it is. And I've actually gone to templatemonster.com, put up all the stuff in the comments below. Um, and I brought this template cost me about I think it's about 60 quid or it might be about 49 quid and I applied a template to WordPress it's very simple to do I'm actually doing some tutorials because I'm actually a, an IT consultant and web designer that's what I did, did in the past um, so I've had over 20 years experience in it so quite good at this sort of stuff so I've actually done another channel where you can actually show people because I get a lot of questions how do you build a website you know what's involved it, oh, I don't want to spend a lot of money and this is the way to do it so I purchased the web space for 123 reg with the database and your emails about 100 pound for the year and then about 60 quid for the template and you got a more pre-built site so with the template for the template monster you can uh, it, I could show you um, do do a search I'll put all the links for this um, below Tem template monster one of the best te template sites and one of the, one of the biggest uh, in the states and the UK as well so um, this is what it looks like so once you purchase your web space um, with 123 edge um, make sure you buy a MySQL database to go with it because you need a database for uh, WordPress then you can download WordPress and then upload it to your site and then here so that here because it's a uh, WordPress stream all I did was go to the CMS admin panel click and search for WordPress templates and this is where you can pick a template you may like so if you go through and um, think, oh, I like that template there, you can click on it. It should then give you a preview of what the template looks like, which is like there. And it shows you it's designed for all different layouts, so mobile phones, uh, or, uh, whether it's portrait or landscape. Uh, same with the iPads, portrait or landscape are working, and obviously on the big screen. Um, these special design templates for WordPress, so they'll come down as a, a single file that you can upload into WordPress. It comes with demo data, so let me let me show what the demo data is. It comes with the proper Photoshop files. If you think if you're quite good at Photoshop, you can actually change uh, the colours and the box and things like that level and stuff like that. So this is what it looks like on different mobile devices when you rotate rounds. But um, yeah, so click on live data. It comes with live data, so it's it's that's quite good because you can then see how it looks with the data involved. Then you can go log into WordPress in the back end and you can change all the functionality so these menus here you can change you can change the graphic behind this and all the wording and lettering on, on there as well you can customize all this look um, on the template as well to match your photographs so no matter what uh, I tend to shop when I buy templates I tend to shop for what I'm looking for so if I like the the, out, the, the, the actual design like the, 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 lay, the menu layouts and the wording and how the images are put here I think oh yeah I can do that then I'll change the images around it to match my own images. So just because it's themed as a, like a food or a restaurant type um, theme, um, you can customize this to be whatever you want it to be, basically. So if I like the, the background colors, the menus, layouts here, this is what I tend to go for, is the design, not what it looks like now. And as you can see, when you bounce up and down, the image here shakes behind, so it looks it's like three-dimensional. But this will give you like a bit more function how, how it works. And all the demo data you see on, on here is what you get. And when you go into WordPress, you can actually then um, change all the wording to match what you want it to be. So if you want these linked to different pages on your site, you can do all that in WordPress. As simple as that. That's how easy it is. So and they they, have, they have like on here they have hundreds, thousands of um, I think there's about see there's nine pages or templates you can go through and you just literally just keep browsing through, find one that sort of similar sort of thing. Oh, that looks nice. I could bolt my information into that. Um, click on live data again. So particularly this template as well, you can see like this is quite nice. You got nice menu layout at the top here. You can see it in Photoshop. You'll get all this in Photoshop. The actual original logo. So you can go into Photoshop, change these word these wordings, or even because you know the size that this image would be when you look at the images, um, you can make sure your it, your logo is in the same size and then it will slot into place nice and easy. WordPress allows you to change the logo, it's very easy to do. Then here this, this is basically called a slider. Slider you can, uh, you don't need to resize the images on the slider, you can actually just tell WordPress to change the images 
and it will resize your images to ma make sure they're nice and big anyway but it will resize your images to what it matches so you can change the slider so it's a nice little feature here and again all this wording here all these 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 buttons here is all pre you can change them all you can even change the graphics the labels very simple to do and my uh, my tutorials I'm doing on my other on my other channel shows you how to change each one of I've done the tutorial on sections on the site like how to customize front page so playing about the menus how to change the menus delete menus you don't want on there um, how to change contact page you can put in there your own sort of address and phone numbers uh, social media buttons at the bottom here and I've also done tutorials on like the blog side blog the blog is the best bit on here uh, I like um, so you can map these to whatever you want it to map to so and as, you, as you can see if you go back to my site so far I've taken out most of the menus here so I thought I'd keep it simple to start with as, as we progress on to know what we're going to put on the, the, the channel uh, we can slowly increase it so for the moment I've got contact so there's a form on there for you to fill out guys with questions and answers uh, this roughly gives you an idea in, in, in the UK where I am so you need to know what area I'm flying, what's around me and stuff like that and obviously my uh, email address. Uh, it's not actually live yet my email address is I haven't actually got done that yet so don't try an email yet but there's a form on the fill anyway you can u use and stuff. So I've done the contact form. News area, this is where I've started changing the blog information to match on here so you can, you can see I've already done a little bit on the upgrade so I've had a nice little sort of like image in here. I'm going to resize that image now because that looks way too big but again, I've got a lot of playing about with to do this. But it tells you about the firmware, and you can go back onto the news. And I've, I've sectioned it down so you've got phantom accessories, so you can easily browse through and category through. So I'm going to put some more stuff up on here. Um, product reviews, so things I'm going to review and, and stuff that I think is quite good. And what other people I've seen that review these, so because I tend to, when I do reviews, I tend to look at what other people are saying about the same thing. So I read up, I read up probably about, I know, half a dozen, maybe more. On, on a particular item, so for instance this uh, fly check stuff and I go through and have a look, see what people comment in, I look at YouTube channels with people talking about it and stuff and if it is something really useful then I'll put it on here and then I'll put all the spec details in it and obviously point to the UK where we can where you can buy it, so heady guy £140 for the fly check stuff so uh, that's how I do my reviews so, um, so product reviews, uh, this is my part um, building my hexcopter build so this is where you'll find more about step by step so this shows you the shortcut to my YouTube channel the video I'm doing so far um, this is the first stage I did and if you go back to the Hexel build then you'll see like I've done a price list so here I'm going to keep updating this this page um, which will then keep adding what I'm buying so far so here you can see what I've bought so far for it and these are the links to uh, where I've purchased them from so most of this is from eBay so this is the eBay seller I purchased from um, as well and uh, on there it's going to be sort of a bit of a I'm, I'm going to take the comments out so you, you can only um, I might leave the comments I'm not sure about comments because um, it can get too messy lots and lots of comments so I'm going to try to keep this nice and slick if I can and on the home front page obviously this is still demo data so I'm going to change all this to my own photographs I've taken I'm going to do a little gallery at the bottom here all, uh, all the stuff because I've got lots and lots of I think I've got over near it nearly 500 gigs of um, videos and uh, photographs I've taken from Phantom so I'm going to put the best of the best on here and then I'm going to change all this to point to different menus different pages so we get more it's not just could be the, about the Phantom I'm going to do it about everything I'm going to do the, the X-Copter build and new gadgets coming out for, that would be useful for us to use all that sort of stuff as well and all the news I'm going to do all the best topics I've got uh, I'm going to put on here as well so <clears throat> I might have some voting, voting stuff on here as well but I'm going to make it really interactive I'm going to make keep it really easy and simple for you guys to navigate around because again I don't want this site to be overcrowded on information I want it to be easy accessible and I think there's on the news I think it's a news section oh it's not actually on I've, I'm going to put on a little search button so there's so you can actually search this one I hang it on so somewhere up the top here I'll put a search bar so you can type in there and put keywords so if you are just a phantom flyer you can type in the words phantom and it will actually then produce a page like this with everything to do with the keywords phantom on it so I'm actually making sure every single page I've got is keyworded as well so you can easily navigate and search for stuff around so um, 
and I'm trying to gonna be I'm trying to keep in contact with all the vendors as well because I want to put a section on here which is news obviously which will hopefully everyone will be able to put me as a press press pass on so I can get all the latest state stuff uh, to hand quite quickly and we can have it all listed here for you guys to keep referring back to and having a look um, so because what I'm gonna do is for this one because I'm gonna buy this controller next um, I will actually add extra information to these so it's not just going to be left as that and that's the end of the hand control I'm actually going to do my little review on here and I'm going to actually demo this on, on a YouTube video for you guys and we'll put the video at the bottom of this page too so we'll be adding to it as well so it'll come quite useful for archiving with anyway so when you come back you can always look at that see what we've, we've put on there um, and, and, and the review and so far so we'll keep filling that sort of information out for you guys um, so if there's anything you guys want to see on my Phantom channel or, or on my new website, anything that's ideal, especially topics, um, uh, accessories, uh, what other gadgets would you like, what other gadgets, can you're not just a Phantom Flyer, you've got other interests as well on the flying side, so is there anything else you particularly want to see added onto this to do with like quadcopters in, in, or, or hexcopters or helicopters, let me know and we'll add all this on here too for you. So I hope you like my new site, which is coming along quite nicely. It's it's live at the moment for me to do all the changes with, but it's not really live to to use as such. Uh, but as soon as it is, I will let you guys know, and I'll tweet it uh, um, on the launch date. But you're happy to come on and browse around, see what and, and watch the changes happen as, as as I do it. So hopefully, next few days I'll get a bit more changed on here, and I'll look for, and try and get this launched before hopefully next week. So I'm going to work, work mad on this and uh, get up and running. All right. So have fun and speak together. Remember to comment. Please subscribe and uh, speak to you the next time. Cheers. Bye. <laughs>